Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Thunder Club House of Horror. I am your episode master, uh, Kaznarius, bringing you together episode 2,679. With me is Rin and Sliver, and I've brought to you a very special creepypasta. Uh, oh, you wanted the name? Uh, it's called uh, Garfield's Terrible Joy. I'm going to add in lightning sound effects after this post. If somebody is. I guess Sliver is. Alright. Sliver, take us off. I'm a Alex. pretty big fan of Garfield. You know the comic strip character that's the fat orange cat with the black stripes that loves lasagna? I probably do know about him. And his huge fan base. Garfield has TV sh ha Garfield had some TV shows like Garfield and Friends. The majority of these were hand-drawn shows, and followed most of the traits that the comics had. But there is one show I want to talk about called The Garfield Show. This was a computer animated show that was like Garfield and Friends, but much better quality and a few more characters. I loved watching this show, and so many others did that they had to keep it going to this day. But the show was supposed to stop at season 4, for reasons I'll tell you in a second. When I was at a garage sale looking at some stuff to get, my eyes laid on a Garfield DVD, which has the first four seasons of the Garfield show. So I asked if I could pay for this, and the guy said, Take it for free! I was so overjoyed that I ran... I was so overjoyed that I ran to my house and put it in my DVD player. It started at the intro, where I could choose an episode from seasons one to four. But at the very bottom of the list was an episode called Garfield's Horrible Joy. I had no idea what this episode was, but out of curiosity, I clicked on it. I wish I hadn't clicked on it. It started with Garfield sitting on the chair and eating what looked like a dog's ear. It was a little confu- I was a little confused, but I thought it was just a little bit of lasagna. When Normal came over and said- Hi, and kept bragging about how he's the cutest cat in the world. This is when things got scary. Garfield then closes his eyes. For two seconds, they stay closed. Then he opened his eyes, revealing two bloodshot eyes. Then Garfield grabbed Normal by the neck and threw him against the wall. Then he pulled out a butcher knife that already had blood on it, indicating that he had already killed something with it, and then slowly approached Normal. I was terrified at what I saw. Pause. Uh, where the fuck does Garfield keep the butcher knife? In the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so he sees Normal, and he pulls out his butcher knife by fucking booking ass to the kitchen. Hey, hey, he's sitting in a chair eating food. Is he not eating in his kitchen? I mean, I usually don't eat right beside my fucking utensils. Like, although I guess everyone eats beside their utensils. No, I think yeah. yeah, a little bit. Holy oh, shit. Although, who eats with a butcher's knife? Garfield. The same Apparently Garfield. bad cat that's eating a dog's ear. My apologies, Rin. I was terrified of what I saw, but had to see what happened. Then Nermo opened his eyes, revealing to him Garfield, with the bloodshot eyes and a knife. Wait, w fucking what? <laughs> Normal opened his eyes, revealing to Garfield, Garfield. Yeah, he's reflected in the eyes. Oh, oh shit, I forgot eyes are eyes. <laughs> that feel when your eyes are <laughs> eyes? Man, I'm kind of having problems sometimes when my Garfield eyes Then Garfield stabbed Normal in the stomach, making blood spatter everywhere. Then came something that scared me for life about eating meat. Garfield ripped open Nermal's chest and ate his intestines, all the while Nermal screaming to death. I threw up at the sight, but had to see the end regretting it. After that, Garfield went up the stairs and saw John working on his computer. Then John turns around. Oh, hey Garfield! Ah! And died. Before John died, Garfield did something scary. Then it showed a close-up of the front door. For ten seconds, nothing happened. Then Garfield's face appeared. He had a demonic, sharp teeth, 
and the huge bloodshot eyes and a message repeating, repeatedly flashed on the screen, saying, I'm gonna kill you, Sam, 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 with a demonic voice. I immediately took the disc and smashed it to bits, and I will never see Garfield or any cat again. Because every time I see a cat, I always see those red bloodshot eyes. Watching that disc has let out a demon, and that demon is after me. As I record this, Gar <laughs> me, period. As I record this, period. Garfield is slamming on my door, meowing his normal meow from the show. And I know that when he kills me, period, the last thing I will see are those red bloodshot, bloodshot eyes, period. And that was Garfield's Horrible Joy by uh, Author Unknown. I assume their name was Sam. It could be Sam. May maybe Sam will teach me the secrets of getting four seasons of a TV show into one disc. But you never know. Oh, it was a DVD. It was a DVD. Yeah, it's it's true. Ain't no Blu-ray, Rin. Gotta pay attention. Unless it's HD DVD. It could have been. Could have been HD. Been All of you are missing the huge details, okay? There are a lot of periods. The oh, the, the huge details like uh, the butcher's knife. Or Cox's final form. <laughs> <laughs> um... <laughs> Yeah, uh... Yeah, that's... That was Garfield's horrible dream. That <laughs> horrible joy. Uh, horrible dream. I guess... <laughs> Garfield's horrible dream. Fuck. <laughs>